In our studios today, New Zealand war artist Captain Peter McIntyre, whose paintings are now being shown through the country, is working on his portrait of Brigadier Bowbank. There's something we want to ask this artist. Captain McIntyre, why do we have war paintings when we can get war photographs? Um, that's a question people have often asked me. I think it was really proved in the last war by people like Augustus John and uh, Orpin. Somehow they proved that the human being is more sensitive to atmosphere and can somehow record in color the epic deeds of a war far more than the camera can. In North Africa, we found that so often Photographic shots showed odd figures wandering across the desert, whereas in a painting, you could show what actually happened, the magnificent sweep of artillery across the desert wastes and so on. The color itself was something that seemed to show in pictures what people really wanted to know about the war. <laughs> 